We're just now figuring it out. Well, here's a graphic that I think points it out. Question for everyone. When did you first use AI? When did you first begin using AI? And many people will say, well, fourth quarter of 2022 when ChatGPT launched and all that became very popular. That's an answer. Maybe you were a later adapter and sometime during 2023 you began using AI. Have you ever used a, a tool called spell check? That's AI. Okay, why don't we go back to the 1970 era and use spell check? Here's an embarrassing tool that you've probably used, autocomplete. Every time you do that with your, when you're sending a message, have you embarrassed yourself with something that it completed for you and you didn't go back and check it? Always go back and check AI. Chat GPT for me was the embryo. It's just the beginning. And where we are right now, we're looking at this question that you continue to ask. People are continuing to ask, what are the multiple platforms I need to be looking at? The answer to that question is different for everyone on the planet. You find the platform, you find the tools, you find the resources that will help you go where you want to go. Then if you move backwards from that, you can figure out how to brand yourself. You can figure out what your brand must be saying or could be saying, but it's going to be different for everyone. And maybe some of the resources that we're using today will think are in the future, just too simple. I don't do that anymore. Or you may find that some of the resources that you selected are growing with you. That's the one you want. Do they have deep pockets behind them and good minds behind them? And they continue to grow. So when you're picking your engines, well, pick one. And as far as the future goes, we don't have a clue. We have no idea what's coming next with AI.